that's the that's a nouveau rouge that she got. Slow. Yes. What the 60s represented was a kind of rebellion against a lot of things. But in the theater and music specifically, we had been working quietly in different kinds of cellars and attics, trying out different forms. Look, I don't even care if that one overlaps, overlaps. but yeah. just come in on your beat. The relationship, the communication between the audience and the, and the performance itself had to become a very kind of solidified plastic product. Our, that whole surge of energy was to break that down, to break through the proscenium, so to speak, to get... It was one of the great forces of the time, too. And, and right now, after all the things that have happened, it seems a little strange and irrelevant, but uh, it was a terrific job, I mean, um, just to go through the proscenium, to break that down, and that was a very important uh, form. And I think, you know, every so often the theater solidifies itself, uh, social mores do and they have to be attacked many different ways. It needs it again.